Hi everyone. In this video we are going to see about forms of crime based on the topic white collar crime. White Collar Crime The famous criminology professor Edwin H. Sutherland coined the term white collar crime as the crime committed by a person of respectability and high social status in course of their occupation. White collar crimes are crimes that committed by people of high social status who commit their crimes in the context of their occupation. This includes embezzling, stealing money from one's employer, in any kind of criminal activities done by well-known or respected person of the society or nation. Mostly general public, employ and organization are victimized of these kind of crime. Such type of crime are happens due to ego, or some hidden interest. Characteristics of white-collar crime enunciated with street crimes. Direct access to the victim on offender's high position. Because of his, her position the offender has direct access to the victim. Example when a thief commits a theft in a house, he first breaks the door or window and then commits the crime. Therefore, before committing theft a thief must first gain access to the house by entering it. Whereas this is not in the case of white collar crimes because the white collar offenders have easy and valid access to their targets. No information about the offender. Most of these crimes are committed by offenders without coming face to face with the victim. Political connections. Most of the offenders have big political connections and somewhere the politicians are also involved in the said crimes. Therefore, it is difficult to take any action against such offenders. Harm to society. These types of offenders can cause great harm to the public as well as to the institutions and organizations. Street Crime This is the crime happening on the base of streets and highways. When people, politician, and media talk about crime then it is called street crime. Street crime are highly happened in underdeveloped and developing nations rather than developed nation but in some highly advanced nations street crime is also at high rate. These type of crime can be profession of people due to poverty, low education, low status in society so people involved in these type of crime are usually from low status and low economic family. Divided into two part. Violent crime, murder, rape, robbery etc. Property crime, motor vehicle theft, burglary theft, lani theft. Causes of white collar crime. Greed. High class people are financially stable. However, they still commit crime because of their greed to earn more. And for this purpose, they even choose illegal ways to have an economic gain. Competition. Darwin in his theory of evolution has stated that, survival of the fittest, is necessary and thus there will always be competition for survival. However, some people for their own greed and in order to get ahead of their peers commit crimes. No fixed laws or punishment. After committing the crimes most of the offenders get away without getting any punishment because there are not enough laws to deal with such kind of crimes. In many cases, because of the supreme political connections most of the offenders get away without any punishment. Moreover, in many cases there are no witnesses for the said offenses as such offenses are committed in private. White Collar Crimes in Various Professions White collar crimes can be found in every industry and profession. Below enunciated here is five major forms of white collar crime. White Collar Crimes it can be found in every industry and profession. 
below enunciated here is five major forms of white collar crime. Medical profession. White collar crimes in the medical profession is not a new phenomenon and has been into existence from very beginning. Some of the offenses which are considered as white collar crime in the medical profession includes providing false medical certificates, illegal abortions, selling of banned drugs and medicines to patients or chemists. Moreover, the people in medical profession makes misleading claims through advertisements in newspapers and television. Education Nowadays, education is only considered as a source of making money. Educational institutions are least bothered about providing quality education to the students. In order to make money for themselves, many educational institutions are engaged in the business of providing fake educational certificates. In government institutions, the teaching staff are often found to be indulged in corrupt activities. Teachers hardly teach their students in school and often blackmail them to take private tuitions. Engineering and IT Substandard materials are being used for construction of buildings, roads and dams, which not only endangers life of many citizens but also result into huge losses to the government. Any illegal access of computer and internet services is known as internet fraud. This kind of fraud is very common these days and the most vulnerable to such incidents are the people who use internet and mobile banking services. Business Edwin Sutherland researched on large number of companies and corporations in the United States and concluded that most of them were involved in illegal contracts, infringements against copyrights and trademarks, unfair trade practices, bribery etc. These types of crimes are generally committed by big businessmen and tycoons. The Sanathanam Committee report on prevention of corruption expressed great concern about the problem of hoarding, profiteering and black marketing. It was also observed by the committee that Indian businessmen build up secret stocks of foreign exchange abroad, violating the imports and exports laws. Society White collar crimes are not only restricted to professions. Individuals, whether belonging to higher class or middle class are also part and parcel of such crimes. E.g. Often individuals misrepresent the details about their income in order to pay low income tax, which is considered as a crime. Non-payment of taxes or non-compliance of tax paying policies is referred to as tax evasion. The tax evaders are either punished with huge fines or imprisonment or both. Moreover, the offenders in certain cases try to hide the source and destination of income received by them. This offense is known as money laundering and it is done with the intention of making it seem that the money have come through legitimate means. Thanks for watching if you like this videos thumbs up and subscribe to watch more videos only on QT Media Future Criminologist. Follow us on Facebook, Instagram, WhatsApp, LinkedIn, YouTube, Twitter and Gmail.